Aloha everyone! Today we're here at Don Quixote to do the Washoku Challenge. Uh, I'm here to buy some of the freshest ingredients and best Japanese products that Hawaii has to offer. Let's come check it out. Hi, my name is Jen. I'm a law student at William S. Richardson School of Law. And on the side, I run a food Instagram called Take a Bite High, where I go around and eat some of my local favorite foods. And I also do some home cooking as well. And so I use my Take a Bite High platform to share all of my favorite spots and some of my family recipes. So here in Hawaii, um, our Don Quixote has a lot of UH products here that you can get. So today I'm going to cook a Japanese snapper in a chili and lime sauce, as well as a wagyu steak. Wow. And here are some um, snapper that we can cook today. They have some amazing sliced um, beef here. Love eating this for yakiniku or shabu shabu sometimes. Here we have some of the best Japanese meat. So, I mean, you can't go wrong with a Japanese wagyu. It's my absolute favorite place to be at Don Quixote. It's a Japanese food street. It has literally all of the Japanese food products here in Don Quixote. So, let's check it out. Oh, I found it. So, here in Hawaii, we love the Sun Noodle brand. And they have it here at Don Quixote. These are some fresh kedama noodles, and I love making some ramen for my family. I got everything I need at Don Quixote, so let's get to the kitchen and get cooking. Now we're here at the kitchen. We're gonna cut our um, fresh snapper. Um, so all I'm gonna do is just score the meat. I'm just gonna do a crisscross pattern as you can see here. Yeah, that's it. So now that we have our oil in the pan all heated up and ready, we're now ready to fry our fish. Wow, look at, oh, the fish is fried. <laughs> it looks really good. And then put this right in here. Now that we deep fried our fish, we're going to prepare our sauce. So I'm going to put in garlic first. Yeah. Put in our garlic. And then we have our shallots red onions that we cut earlier, carrot, and celery. And then I'm going to add this, add some sugar. And the last thing I'm gonna do is add the rest of our lime. And this is our Japanese snapper with Thai chili and lime sauce. Up next, we're gonna do a very simple wagyu steak. So I got this at Don Quixote, and after seeing this beautiful marbling, I just had to get it. So the very first thing that we're gonna do is just simply salt and pepper. It's the first and last thing we're gonna do. I think I'm gonna cook maybe about a minute on each side. Let's flip it over. Wow, okay, there you go. So I'm gonna let it rest for just a little bit, and so I'm just gonna cut it. And that's it, our wagyu steak is done. So I made some Thai snapper um, using Chef Thai's recipe. Um, I made sure to deep fry the fish and I put on the lime and chili sauce on top. So let's take a bite and see how I did. Mm. You can, I got to really, there's the fish sauce in there, the lime in there, that's really, really good. So here it is, I made wagyu steak um, and you know, Wagyu steak is such a high quality from Don Quixote. 
And so I just really wanted to taste like that fresh flavor of the Wagyu. And so that's why all I did was a simple salt and pepper seasoning. So let's give it a try. Mm. You can taste all of that fat, which is just incredible. Yeah, that's really good. You're next. Why don't you give Washoku Challenge a try? And when you do, make sure to post it on social media. And don't forget to hashtag Washoku Challenge.